While robotic process automation, or RPA, is a relatively new market in the world of technology, enterprise organizations have been automating labor-intensive IT processes for many years. RPA represents many technological advances that enable enterprise IT to programmatically access data from the final frontier of application platforms, the mainframe. RPA and IT, a brief history. Every day, evolving technology simplifies the work of enterprise computer users. For example, we already use automation, macros, and scripts to perform tasks like automatically logging into an application, generating complex reports from various sources on a regular cadence, and processing large batch jobs in the middle of the night when the network is less busy. Some technologies have taken what's possible to the next level, moving from a macro that automates a short process in a single application to automating a complicated business process from end to end by orchestrating the exchange of data between desktop, web, and other applications. Meet Robotic Process Automation. RPA. RPA is a practical, non-invasive way to automate enterprise processes. Using software robots to perform everyday tasks boosts productivity while preserving underlying applications and IT infrastructures. Robots interact with applications and systems similar in the way we humans do, but are faster, more articulate, and highly secure. They save time, reduce costs, and free employees to work on other projects. Next steps, RPA and the mainframe. With so much important business data housed on the mainframe, it is logical to leverage RPA for mainframe initiatives, but accessing mainframe data can be more complicated. Since this data is business critical and mainframe security is paramount, using RPA with the mainframe must be done right. Involving the mainframe team in the project matters, as they better understand the specific needs of this platform. Interacting with a desktop or web-based application is typically straightforward, but accessing data on host systems typically requires special skills and technology, leading many organizations to choose their mainframe team to lead RPA initiatives that involve Big Iron. MicroFocus supports a full range of RPA developer requirements, whether integrating via a web services API approach or via a client terminal emulator, Halopi or .NET, often referred to as a user interface-based approach. Accessing mainframe data. Historically, the market has created many ways to programmatically access mainframe data. IBM's Halopi became the de facto standard that originated with DOS, yes, that DOS, and morphed into many related automation interfaces as the Windows operating system evolved. Enabling mainframe RPA can be broken down into two primary methods, service enabling the mainframe and Halopi. We also refer to these respectively as API and UI-based approaches to programmatically accessing host data. The first, more scalable method gives RPA developers the ability to create consumable web services that perform units of work in host-based applications. The RPA developer uses an RPA tool, like the MicroFocus RPA product, to call on these RESTful web services as needed. We call this service enabling the mainframe, or host. The alternative is to use Halopi, the green screen data access standard for more than 30 years. In this scenario, the RPA tool leverages Halopi to access host data through a client terminal emulator and corresponding green screen. Every major RPA solution on the market supports this standard interface for mainframe data access. For the Halopi savvy organization, this can be the quickest way to leverage mainframe data in an RPA-based automated process, but the web services approach are more scalable and elegant. MicroFocus supports both methods in a single solution to meet the requirements of any RPA developer that needs programmatic access to host-based data. Our new host access for RPA solution includes MicroFocus Veristream for service enablement and MicroFocus terminal emulation solutions for their Halopi interfaces, including a dot net option. What's next? Your journey to RPA and the mainframe can start today. Whatever method of RPA you choose, your organization will be able to leverage your business critical mainframe data in your RPA initiatives. Best of luck with your RPA initiatives.